Wow, all right, here we go. You know what sucks? So this is how it happened, right? So I'm just sitting there, minding my own business, doing my own thing, and then I started to get up, and then I wanted to move to the left. Wait. Move to the left, and then what the fuck? I hate it when that happens. It's been a long time. Anyway, let's talk about what happened when I was away. What happened? I had a burger, I think. Went to the park, did some work, or something like that. About and also Pokemon. I Pokemon. Pokemon. All oh, right, this is a Pokemon channel. So let's talk about Pokemon then. I guess. So while I was away, few things that happened. Number one, I did not get a shiny Meltem. No shiny Meltem. Number two. <laughs> you said number two. <laughs> And this is my favorite one because you're gonna see it, alright? I hatched a shiny why not? You know? I hatched a shiny why not? I mean like, you know, I'm so damn happy about it because, you know, I already have one and of all the babies, I hatched another shiny why not? I I'm just so happy that I got a shiny why not instead of a shiny togepi because I'm freaking hurt! It seems that the doctor has prescribed me some medication for my rage. I need to control myself, at least for a bit. Several months later. Ooh, 7 km. Come on. Daddy need a shiny toga. Hey. Many months later. Okay, I'm back. I swear, I'm good. Second thing that happened was that I had a shiny. Why not? I'm not gonna get angry again. And I was able to find a shiny Marie. I've been mean, trying to find a shiny Spoink for the longest, longest time. I think I clicked like over a hundred Spoink. No shiny. The only Marie I ever clicked during that event, the Chinese New Year event, it was a freaking shiny. That ever happened, you guys. Fourth thing is we have a Perugly. Now I don't even have the first stage of this guy, but I found him in the wild a few days back. So yeah. Pokedex entry. Are we at the fourth thing right now? Yeah. Fifth thing. I found a combi. Now this is not very interesting because combis are quite, I want to say, you know, more, less rare. What? The hell am I talking about, man? More frequent than the others like uh, Shudan or, you know, mine is a male combi. So I can't even evolve this to the Vespa Queen. But anyway, today's episode is we're gonna be having Shiny Swine Up. Shiny Swine Up Community Day is today. Green fur ball. Uh, that's gonna evolve into Pillow Swine. I mean Pilo Swine. And Pilo Swine will evolve into Mammal Swine. So Mammal Swine is gonna be huge in PvP because it's the best ice attacker. But the new thing is that it can learn Ancient power, which recently got buffed because it will have ad added uh, status effect. Okay, so I have like an hour or so. All right, I'll see you guys there. What you doing? Climbing. So we arrive at our location and she's just chilling out, you know, because that's what we do best. We chill out all the time. And the good thing about this community day, hold on, my camera's a bit weird. Okay. The good thing about this community day, right, is that um, Swine Up is a ground type and an ice type. And I actually have these two quests that I've been dying to like get it over with, which is 10 catch 10 ground type Pokemon. I cannot find a ground type Pokemon in anywhere that I live, so thank God for that. How long are you gonna be up there? I'm coming down now. Oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna have a bunch of swine ups spawning soon. Uh, we have one here, which is not a shiny. Which is perfectly fine because I'm not expecting to find a lot of shiny swine ups today. Since I am terrible at. Sh She's not playing this day. I got things to do. She actually stopped playing Pokemon Go for a long time already. So if you guys didn't know, the shiny queen has retired for a while. Maybe one day when something else is interesting to play for, she will play. More swine ups. Nope. Wow, that's a lot of swine ups. Is this a shiny? Nope. Okay, so we are done with two of the 10 ground type Pokemon quests and there's a shiny swine up here, potentially. No. Um, Alright, let's see if we can get that shiny Sandshrew because I'm pretty sure those are the rewards for these quests. Uh, here we go. No, not a shiny Sandshrew. Come on, shiny Sandshrew. No. Okay, never mind. But we do have one more quest that is a uh, new 
uh, spinner, which uh, have a little heart shape on the eye. Or is it his forehead? I can't remember. Okay, so while we're hunting for shiny swine ups, which I'm not really having the best of luck, let's try to challenge one of you guys to see if you're online to fight, you know, for PvP. I'm just... Is this better? Yep. Okay, let's see if you're playing. I think you should be playing right now. It's community day. I'm sorry if I'm disrupting your swine up... I don't know. <laughs> swine up uh, hunting. Probably busy with all the swine ups, like... I am too. But yeah, bottom line is you need to, you can battle 10 times a day, 5 against your own team leader, 5 against any trainer, so you can get 10 Sinnoh Stones to evolve as many Mammal Swine as you want, but obviously I'm only going to evolve like maybe 2, because the rest of it is going to be for my other Pokemons that I haven't evolved yet. Guys, it happened, it happened, finally, my first ever Shiny Swine up. That took longer than I expected, and to be honest, getting a great throw on a swine up, it's not easy as you think. It's freaking hard. Okay, watch. Okay, I don't know how I hit a great throw for that, but yeah, it's been very hard for me to get five great throws in a row. I'm just telling you. Okay, here we go. Okay, we have a lot of sign up here. Like, a lot. Like, fuck loads a lot. <laughs> I don't know what to do. There's like too many to press at the moment. Are you guys seeing the spawn? Look at this. I'm surrounded by... Whoa. Something that looks like chocolate. This looks like Kinder Bueno, right? Yeah. Yeah. Kinder it bueno. kind of looks like a chocolate. Problem with too many spawns. I cannot keep track which one I clicked already and which one I haven't. So, never mind. Still gotta catch them all too, you know? This is a shiny. Let's come up. Making grunt. Run. Don't run away, don't run away. Yes! <laughs> I knew we would find one. Well, thank God we found one, another one. So this is our second one. Um, I already did four great draws in a row. So this could be the fifth one. Or I could potentially mess the entire thing up. Look! Please don't screw this up. Oh my god, I just needed one more great throw, but it's okay because I have another shiny swine up. So, I, I don't know why I don't sound as excited, but yeah, I am very excited. Okay, we have found our third and shiny, third and shiny, what? Third shiny swine up and she wants to sit on the bicycle. Out of the way, people. <laughs> third shiny swine up, not bad. Uh, I think I more or less already hit my quota for today, as in like, I'm good to go. What you doing? I'm riding. She see me riding, she hating. What am I singing? Let's go inside. I'm cycling. Let's go inside. There's a lot of people inside, so you guys are gonna see how many people is playing today. Let's get it, guys. We have our fourth. Shiny swine up for today. But yeah, let's catch this shiny swine up first. So here we go. Uh, why am I making unnecessary noises? Alright, we found another one. Fifth one for today. Simpler than I thought. We still have another about one hour and 15 minutes for the event. So maybe we'll evolve one of the swine up soon, but not just yet. Shiny? <gasps> in a row. <laughs> That's our sixth swine up. Awesome stuff, guys. I have never gotten triple back-to-back -back swine ups before. So if I could potentially get a triple back-to-back -back swine up, that would be kind of cool. So is this a triple back-to-back -back swine up? No. Okay, which means I should go eat now because I am actually quite hungry and I have enough swine ups already. I have six. I'm actually quite happy with that. We're currently at a bookstore, right, that is recently opened at Paragon Mall. And you see like there's this big ass shelf here, but there's so little books around. It's a bit, I feel like wasted space. We have a shiny swine up, 
here with all these books and stuff. I guess this Chinese one up decided to be reading. So yeah, cool. I don't know what's this number already. I lost track of time because I was eating just now. Okay, we're just chilling out, sitting down here, and I found another shiny swine up that happens to be reading under this lamp. Right. How many is this already? I already lost track. And Law don't like to read. I really like the show. Alright, we're gonna continue looking around the bookstore. We're going to do some evolution right now. We're going to do some evolution of swine ups to hilo swine and then memo swine. Okay, here we go. Our whoa, look at that. Our orange color friend. This looks like this looks like one of those characters. I don't know. I find my shiny pilo swine looks kind of cool. Okay, it's going to be our first ever shiny memo swine. I think it's very very awesome. Oh my god, that thing looks weird. It looks sick. It looks like it's going to barf. But here we have Mammal swine in our Pokedex. Awesome stuff. We are going to head towards. Okay, look. Powder Snow, Ancient Power. Okay, nice. Alright, I'm going to evolve another swine up just because I need more Pokemon that can have Ancient Power. I think I should be saving a lot of my Sinnoh Stone and not evolve too much Mammal swine because I don't really need them. No? Not really. Okay, we are done with Swine Up Community Day. But we are not going to end the episode just yet because we actually have one more Pokemon to catch which is our Spinda. This is our Spinda that has a heart shape on its eye. Look at that. What are you doing? I'm dancing. Valentine's Day Spinda. Very cute. Here we go. Spinda going in our Pokedex I guess. So far not bad. I would say this community day I got 8 shiny swine ups without really trying too hard. So. Yeah, it's been a very good day. How many shiny swine up do you guys get? Let me know. And it's time to cross the road, and that means I'm gonna end the episode right here, guys. Um, catch you guys in the next episode. So let me know what you guys wanna see next. All right, take care, guys, and bye bye. Peace out. Peace out, yo.